how to transfer the master administrator to another company admin in QuickBooks Online. I'm going to go ahead and click on the gear icon, go to Manage Users. So that's where it's all going to kind of be initiated from. You come in here to invite other users or the accounting firm, right? And they accept the invite there in QuickBooks Online Accountant. But sometimes you do want to transfer the master admin to somebody else, maybe to someone in the firm for wholesale billing, you know, maybe to the accountant user, or maybe to just another person in your company. Tab's right here, but in order to transfer it, you need another name, another person. So you're going to go ahead and click New, and you're going to create a company admin. And that's my scenario here. I'm just going to click uh, Create a Company Administrator to transfer it through. You just enter their email address. First and last name is optional. Click Next. And then Finish. And now in the file, you'll see I have two names. However, I still can't transfer it yet because it's pending, right? So Abby has to actually accept the invite. Abby's going to get this email. She clicks here to accept the invitation. She sees her user ID associated with QuickBooks.com and then puts in her password and accepts the invite Then signs in. Now I actually have an active user and status is active, no longer pending. And since Abby is a company admin, I can click transfer master administrator and I'll see her option right here. If you have others, including your accountant user, you'd see the option there that you could transfer it to. In this case, it's just another user in my business. I'm transferring it to Abby. So choose your name, click finish. Now at this point, nothing's going to happen. I'm still the master admin because Abby has to accept the invite for the master administratorship. So let's go be Abby again. And now in Abby's email, she gets this. You've been granted master administrator privileges for the company file. Click here to accept, which we're going to go ahead and do. Now, currently at the time of this video, transferring the master admin does take you back through the old classic view of QBO, which is kind of nostalgic for those of you that remember. So now Abby signs in and she wants to get this message. Master account administrator privileges for a company have been successfully transferred to you. An email has been sent to the former master admin confirming the transfer, at which point she goes ahead and logs out. And back in the QuickBooks Online file under Manage Users, you'll see that Woody is now the company admin and Abby is the master admin. And that is how you transfer the master administratorship to another company admin or the accountant user, again, for the wholesale billing scenario within QuickBooks Online.